Hello and welcome to the Crafty Cauldron. I am Jo Beth and I am here to give you a quick review um, of an Etsy store that is, they offer um, digital downloads for whatever your purposes are. Um, I don't remember how I found this store. I think I was just looking and they were, it was one of the suggested stores, but their downloads, their digitals aren't, they're not the, the usual stuff that you might find. Yes, there are stores that, you know, every store is different and, and all of that, but a lot of stores have a lot of roses and birds and things like that, which are wonderful and I use them all the time. However, this store has a little bit different. It's a little bit different, has stuff that's a little bit different there. That's what I'm trying to say. So the name of this store is Digital Droplets. Can you guys see that? I feel like it's washed out because my lighting is always kind of weird. There, 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 there. That's better. Digital Droplets. And it still looks washed out. Okay, so there's the name of the store. Now, here's my sampling. Um, one of the things I got to tell you is the store owner, Melanie, and they're in Australia. She is really, really cool. Um, they have, or at least they did have, a sale going on in their store. And it was digitals that were like 58 cents and 72 or 75 cents or something like that. But, oh my gosh, look at this stuff. And... What happened was I bought a couple of digitals on sale and it came to like a total of $2. And then um, she said, you forgot to leave your feedback. And I was like, oh, I can do that. So she goes, and then tell me which, which free digitals you want. And I was like, really? Because I totally didn't see that part. But um, I, uh, I went and left the feedback and then I... I was like, what links are you talking about? And during the time, you know, during the time that I, between the time I sent the the message on Etsy and I got the answer, I figured out, oh, 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 she, she said free, okay, free items. Okay, so here's what we have. This is one of the ones I bought. It's called, it's a Mystical Stripes Pack. And this, I don't know if you can see that, it's got little stars on it and they have, they're colored so that they appear to be glowing. So it's kind of bluish, and this one is on cardstock. It's on cream-colored cardstock, because that's what I have. Um, and then I also printed it on regular paper, copy paper, but it's also cream-colored, very, very light cream-colored. So there's that. I just love this. Look at the saturated colors. Look at how bright and happy they are. It's wonderful. So there's one pack. And then this one is called Mystical Fantasy Vintage. Oh, I think that's upside down. Mystical Fantasy Vintage, and it's it's got these wonderful, um, it's teal and and like um, pinkish red, and then some yellowish, like rust colored, and it is. These are all. Most of these are 12 by 12, but you can resize them really easily. In fact, this one was a 12 by 12, and I just resized it to do an eight and a half by 11, which made it larger than it would have been but it's still printed up really nicely. So their, their files are just fabulous. They're, they're large files and they, they translate really well. So, um, there's that one. And then this is mystical fantasy vintage with uh, washi stripes and I don't have any sticker paper, but I printed them up anyway, because I mean, you can glue them down, right? But it's got like, the teal, and then it's got like little um, curly cube, almost a fleur de, fleur de lis, and then it's got some here with little curly cues, almost a paisley design. Here it's got a floral, and then there's there's old English writing in this one. Let's see if I can get that closer. I love the one with the writing on it. And then this one has a diamond background. It's got some, some shadowy diamonds in it, if you can see that right there. Again, I printed it on cream cardstock and copy paper. So the cardstock is here, and then the copy paper is here. The next one is called Mystical Fantasy Vintage as well, but it's not the washi version. And what I did with this one was I printed it up. This is at, this is at 64 opacity, 
because I wanted to see if I could if I could like tone down the colors a little bit and save a little bit of ink and it worked really well really really well I'm very very happy with it so um, those two are printed at the 64% um, opacity and then this one is the full 100% so you can see uh, the difference in colors let me just get this in here you can see how they do indeed translate very very well um, so you can get like you can make it not quite so bright and then you can make it just the original brightness that they send to you so and again these are 12 by 12 so this is printing out a little bit larger than it would have but I also did one where um, where I'll show you in a minute where I, I printed it out so that the pattern would be the original size so this is mystical fantasy vintage as well but it's a different color it's got a lot of blue and yellow but it's faded and then it's got some lavenderish and the writing comes through as kind of a teal greenish color really gorgeous really really beautiful I cannot wait to use these and these these will make great backgrounds for collages they'll make great backgrounds for just pages pockets um, tags you name it for your junk journals wonderful wonderful fodder this one is called wet red water dragons and this one is the one that I printed up so it would be smaller because originally when I had resized it the the design came out really big but it was still clear so I liked that about it too so here you go and my computer my printer started printing lines because I'm running out of ink and this isn't all that I bought it's just that I can't I just put in a new cartridge so I couldn't print up everything obviously ink costs money and we have to order it mail order so it takes a while to get here like a week and office max is like a mile and a half away don't ask me I don't know I can't explain that one so anyway this one is called red water dragons and you can see that it looks like there's like dragon's wings unfurled and all kinds of great patterns in here and um, I really really like it even though there are slight lines in it I'm still going to use it because I really love this this is the one that caught my eye and the reason why I went ahead and, and purchased one from the, a couple of packs from the store because I really like I was looking for something red because I like using red and uh, this worked really well this is gonna this is gonna be fun so again, uh, link below, Digital Droplets is the Etsy store name, and Melanie is the store owner. And if I believe they're still having a sale, I'm not exactly sure because I did not check this morning before I did the video, unfortunately, because I'm a dork. So anyway, um, there you have it. Um, please go check them out if, if, you know, if you feel like this is something you, you will use. Um, and then when you leave your feedback, they'll they'll get back to you with I, I think they're still doing the fr get a free item with every feedback that you leave but um, I'm not sure totally sure I do I do believe that that she will get back to you and do that anyway so yeah you know digital droplets on Etsy and Melanie is the store owner and she is her customer service is wonderful so have a look and thank you for watching. Peace, love, and remember it's not about the destination, it's about the journey. Make it a happy, a crafty, colorful one. Stay safe, wash your hands, and don't touch your face. I will see you all soon. Bye-bye.